So uh, I just so like to show you the, 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 case, the clinical case. Okay, good. So this is a 20-year-old female which has a, a conductive right hearing loss. She has a golden syndrome. Some uh, abnormality of the uh, external auditory atresia, and uh, the uh, contralateral ear is uh, just normal. Also, the uh, bone conducted hearing threshold on the operated ear are normal. So, this is a very good indication for vibrant sunbridge. And uh, here is the audiogram. With conductive hearing loss, and uh, according to the Yarsdorf grading system, uh, about eight points. So this is quite good, or very good. So this is case you saw the abnormal uh, in its course, but a uh, lot of which is just here reposition. It just seems as though there is uh, no osteocular chain, as you can see here on the axial and coronal view, with nice pneumatization of the Lenoir cell and uh, the antrum. The antrum. And so I think this is the increased coupling. This is with the vibrant. Okay, yes, of course, see this that. will be done by means of a posterior tympanotomy. And uh, just uh, what we must uh, know in this case, now in this case, there is no external auditory canal. So about that, uh, to be in the good uh, direction towards the facial nerve. So let's start. Okay, that's a good summary so, uh, of the case. We, we have the background now. So, I, uh, I opened just incision here, post uh, three and a half centimeter. This will be the position of the vibrant sun bridge. And uh, I already uh, prepared some well for the VOP, five, five or three. We have, in fact, an external auditory canal, but there is no. There is no external auditory canal. So, let's start. But I think we will have good anatomic marks. We have just to zoom a little bit the image, please, Alexandra. Zoom, zoom. And uh, so as we saw from the CT, uh, Sebastian, we can see the jugular bulb appearing already. Yes, yeah, already here. And uh, there is no. So I change blur, continue. So usually for vibrant assignment, I don't use facial nerve monitoring. But in this case, despite there is no abnormality of the facial nerve, and uh, I think it's uh, and. Uh, advise to use it. Either in this situation you would use a facial nerve monitor. Yes.
And Just a message for Dubai. Could you connect to Channel One, please? Could you dial into Channel One? So here, here comes the Dura, and so we have to drill much more in Fiori in this area. So we're seeing the middle fossa dura, we're seeing the jugular bulb, so this is a, yes. a challenging case. For this uh, stage, I use a cutting burr at full speed at every time. Every time. Okay. So let's continue. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ja, jetzt müssen wir messen. So here comes the first group. So, uh, Sebastian, some air cells are yes. beginning to appear for you now, I think. Yes. Ich muss gerade noch die Sicht frei machen. Okay. Das ist scharf. Nochmal Video Stopp und Video Start. Okay. Ich hab's hier. Jetzt messen. Yeah. Okay.
Sebastian, just while you develop yes. the master dissection, we're going to go to Bentier, and then we will come okay. back to you. Okay. Okay, um, Sebastian, uh, we have yes. your image of the uh, the vibrant sound bridge and the tools that you have there. So we are with yes. You okay, thank you. So give me the uh, LP in kiss. So, this is the uh, FMT, and now I'll show you how to, how to fix the LP in kiss point. So, this is a right P in kiss floor. Yes. I will show you later on the uh, posterior tympanotomy, which is very large. So uh, it's a good indication in this case. The reason why uh, I didn't choose a uh, short process of the incus was because of the uh, possible uh, abnormality of the middle ear and uh, at the first and second arch with the uh, ossicles. And, uh, I had some experience, uh, especially in pediatric case, where there was a malia incus block and a hypermobile uh, ossicular chain. So this can be somehow dangerous. So, and uh, the best option in this case is LP incus in a regular way. So you just fix it, fix it this way, and you push. And then you remove this part, and here it comes. You see, it's so easy. So at, at, at very first, for my first cases with these couplers, I thought uh, it would be with this too bulky, too large. In fact, it's not. So, uh, point? Yeah, we can see that very nicely. We can see that very yes, nicely. Yes, yes. So, this one, this one, and then you just push it onto the uh, long, to the, uh, long, long process of the incus. This, you just push, that's it. And uh, so you have. Two vibroplasty. Yes, two points here, here one, here another one. And here again. So and you see also the fixation in this in this area. And this area. Yeah. Okay. Let's yeah, go. We see, we see that very well. So yeah. so you have. Okay. So back to the middle here. Table pas en avant. So, uh, Sebastian, is the facial yes. nerve in its normal position? Yes, facial Okay, 
is uh, Sebastian, did you need to decompress the jugular bulb or the sigmoid sinus? No, no, I, I, no, I just show you. So I, I've just lost your sound. I, I've just lost your sound. Just wanted to show you. Sebastian, could you just check, yes. your head, ch check your headset because sometimes we're losing your voice. Okay. Is that better now? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you now. Okay, so you see here, fits nicely. And without touching the promontum. I did some drilling at the inferior part of the hypotymponum here, but I think that should be okay. Now, Okay. Uh, and uh, can you show us? Uh, show us the screws or a No, yes. I, I tried to show you some screws. Okay. Let me pick and Here. They detrit, you ready? Okay. So let's go. So you you see, I I did a, a weld for the implant. Yep. And uh, here is a screw. Oh, yeah. Okay. We see, we see that. Okay. Yeah. 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 So here is one and the second one. Yeah. 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 Okay. We get the, we get the picture there. And oh. um, I notice your muscle flap is now coming back. Yes. Or, or can we see the uh, floating mass transduced, you say? Yes. I'll show you. No problem. Yeah, re I'm really sorry to stall you there. No, 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 no problem. So, Okay, that's good. We see it. Yeah. 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 And how do you find this new cl clip system? Is it, Do you find it easier than... Conductor link was pushed onto the uh, pro tympanum, and uh, I check if there is no bony contact, in particular relative to the promontorium, which sure. is not the case. So you see, 
Yeah, we see it's that very, very nice. nicely. Thank, thank you. So, here again. Okay. Fantastic. Thank, thanks for showing us that. 